Drive, 2011 action drama film. This is the limited edition 4K Ultra HD Steelbook by Sony Pictures. This edition also comes with the Blu-ray and a digital code so you can watch the digital version of the movie. But is it really worth paying a premium for this item? Because if you're from Australia, you'll be paying 69 AUD. If you're from the States, you'll be paying 46 USD. And if you're from Great Britain, you'll be paying 34 GBP. And in this video, we'll be going over everything you need to know about this release. But first, here's a little bit of trivia for you. So stay tuned to the end of the video where I'll be revealing the answer to this question. The question is, how much did this film gross in total at the box office with a $15 million budget? A, $11.2 million. B, $32 million. C, $35.4 million. And D, $81.4 million. So stay tuned. Grab your popcorn and your drinks because this video starts right now. This is definitely an aesthetically beautiful 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray release. But having said that, what is the transfer like? Well, for visuals, this does come with a 4K 2160p presentation with Dolby Vision for audio. This does come with Dolby Atmos 5.1 and 2.0. Having said that, this does come with a few features, the majority being on the Blu-ray, but for the 4K, this, this does come with a back in the driver's seat featurette, theatrical trailer for the Blu-ray comes with iDrive featurette, under the hood featurette, driver and Irene featurette, cut to the chase featurette, Drive Without a Driver interview with Nicholas Winding Ref and the director of this film. And having said that, for audios, visuals, this gets a 9 out of 10. For packaging, this gets a 10 out of 10. I mean, look at this release here. You can't go wrong. Looks fantastic. But putting this down for a second and going over the post and pre-production. The soundtrack to this movie is just so euphoric, beautiful. Cliff Martinez is a great composer. When this first came out, I was listening to the soundtrack on a loop. Just such a great soundtrack by Cliff Martinez. But anyways, the film was directed by uh, Danish filmmaker Nicholas Winding Refn, starring Ryan Gosling and Kerry Mulligan. The logline of the movie is this. The film's about a Hollywood stunt driver that works as a getaway driver for the criminal underworld. And it is a great movie, dramatic and action packed. And this film will definitely have you at the edge of your seat to the very end of the movie. But pros and cons, what I liked and what I didn't like about this release. So first and foremost, little to no special features on the 4K. I would have liked to see a lot of new features. Having said that, I definitely like the aesthetics of this 4K release. They did a great job with the artwork. New artwork for this 4K. The design is good. Although this release is a bit dear, it is quite expensive for a 4K. But you do get a Blu-ray with this release. So overall, you know, you've, it's definitely 50-50. Um, and if you are on the fence with this one, I highly recommend upgrading to the 4K if you're a fan of this movie. You can't go wrong there. But wrapping this video up by saying, thank you all for watching. I'm Mike Stuck. Like this video, give it a thumbs up. Drop me down below any questions you may have. And the answer to the question at the start of this video is D. $81.4 million. So if you guessed D, you got it right. So I'm out of you, everyone. And I'll catch you on the next video, folks. Have a good night.